Welcome ladies and gentlemen to this lecture the last five dimensions transform your business into a value centric cash flow machine the real value of the course starts here as i explained before i will be explaining not one two or three but five additional dimensions along which you must optimize your business to remain competitive and leave a legacy in your market these dimensions will accelerate your outbound business transactions many fold and will also make your business more efficient and scale it faster therefore these five dimensions have an amplification effect and further boost the effects of dimensions taught by j abraham in other words they will transform your business into a value centric cash flow machine which will unlock your value at an accelerated rate helping your products services and brand in creating far greater impact note that a business which creates and unlocks value at a higher rate has longevity and resilience and only such businesses make it to the realm of extraordinary where the executives and business owners have overcome both the value perception misalignment problem and the value assess facilitation problem i already explained these two important concepts which might seem obvious but are still neglected by many multinationals and it results in billions of us dollars in losses now let's see what these dimensions are and afterwards we will see examples from various industries to see the way these dimensions play a pivotal role in the success of businesses so the five dimensions which i teach my mentees to shatter the value assess facilitation and value assess misalignment problem work in tandem with the three dimensions taught by j abraham and they reinforce as well as amplify their effect these five additional dimensions are customer loyalty meaning earning the loyalty and trust of customers number 2 joint ventures meaning collaborating with other businesses in the following three ways firstly finding partners in the same industry niche or related niches which can offer complementary products and services to your products and services Secondly combining their values with yours sell the whole package and then split the revenue thirdly create products or services for an other niche or industry by combining your competence and resources with theirs the third dimension is customer retention meaning retaining your existing customers the fourth dimension is market assess meaning find businesses that can introduce you to their customers in this way you can sell to their clients too which would be difficult otherwise and the fifth dimension is co-produce value meaning find partners who can do the task for cheaper or more efficiently than your business in other words you need to ask yourself the question can it be more profitable to rather use resources in your firm for doing something else rather than doing the tasks which you can outsource to reduce costs while maintaining a satisfactory quality so you are aiming at outsourcing the tasks without compromising the quality and in this way you are achieving operational efficiency in other words you are letting another business produce a part of value that is delivered when your business generates a business transaction don't worry about generation of business transaction now everything will become crystal clear in the next section where you will learn the transactional model of business thank you for your time ladies and gentlemen and let's proceed to the next lecture